I apologize. And I'm sorry. I'm sorry we had to defend ourselves against an unwarranted attack. I'm sorry that your crew was stupid enough to fire on a station filled with a quarter million civilians, including your own people. And I'm sorry I waited as long as I did before I blew them all straight to hell. As with everything else, it's the thought that counts. It's the thought that counts. You know, it's funny, I was thinking about what you said. The preeminent truth of our age is that you cannot fight the system. But if, as you say, the truth is fluid, that the truth is subjective, then maybe you can fight the system. As long as just one person refuses to be broken, refuses to bow down. But can you win? Every time I say been interrogated before. Yes. Anyone I know? You're not. I'd be surprised. It's certainly strange. You don't seem to know the rules. Perhaps I should explain them in case you forgot. This is your confession. It goes on at some length. So uh, allow me to summarize. You plead guilty to charges of treason, mutiny, conspiracy to commit mutiny, sedition, terrorism. That's a lie. Conspiracy to overthrow the government. All the missions we've flown. This will be the most difficult. I mean, it's one thing to defend ourselves as we did last year. To initiate combat against our own forces. I can only tell you that we take this action with the utmost reluctance. If there were any other way, we'd take it. You can refuse to surrender. You can refuse to be broken. You just have to say, no, I won't. One more time and they can say yes, you will. Sabotage. Now, just a minute. Willful destruction of public property, disobeying direct orders of superior officers, and the murder of 547 officers and crew on board the EAS board. I won't sign it. You will. Sign it. Sign it, and you will read it aloud in full view of the public so they'll know that we have forged your image or your signature. Your name, your accomplices. You will apologize to the families and friends of those who died fighting you. And in the end, you will beg for mercy on the grounds that you're under the influence of aliens who are trying to subvert the government and undermine the authority of the president. I demand the seat, I demand the presence of the full military tribunal. You have no right! No! You have no right! There's no court here, Captain. No tribunal, no attorney, no justice, no mercy, no fairness, no hope, no last minute escape. You walk through that door when you confess and not one second before. Only one human has ever survived that with an Inbari fleet. The moment you surrender, 